Hi, this is Tanner Gelati, and I'm going to teach you how to tie a double Windsor. The first step you have is to make the, um, the fat part of the tie, like this, come over the skinny part of the tie. Okay, and you're going to want the skinny part of the tie kind of to be up more instead of like, like this. So you want it up here. So you're going to take the fat part of the tie, put it over the skinny part of the tie, okay? Then, after that, you're going to take the fat part of the tie and pull it up through this area right here, the scap. Pull up through here, and then just let it be right there. And then, you're going to take the tie, and you're going to take it and see this area right here? You're going to take this part of the tie, pull it under here, and you'll have it on this side, okay? And then you're going to take the tie and do the same thing you did on the other side. Pull up and through. And then you're going to take it. This is one of the hard, hardest parts about the tie and the tie. You're going to take it and you're going to come over the top of all this stuff. So it's going to look like that. Okay, and then you're going to take this part of the tie, pull up through the neck area, and have it be like this, okay? Then there's going to be, you remember when we pulled it over the top of everything? There's going to be a little gap. It's going to look like that when you look down, and you're going to take the tie and put it through that little gap and when you get it, pull it out the other side of the gap. Then it's going to look a little big like this. So you want to, you know, you want to um, straighten it out a little. You don't want to straighten it out. And then you're going to want to, and if you want it to be more triangular, like that, like if you want it to be like triangle, like a triangle up here, you're, you're going to pinch it and then pull it up and it'll be just like that. And then that's how you tie the double winter. Thank you for watching.